Well, have you ever been curious as to how our police officers are trained? Our Alexandra Cohen Yard's got an inside look at some of the patrol police officer training in North Idaho. She shares how one essential part of that training is now at risk. This track right behind me is currently where the officers you see out on the street in North Idaho are trained to operate their vehicles. Now, due to safety and space concerns, this is changing, making it uncertain where these officers are going to be able to get that essential part of training. That is the sound of a cadet learning to operate an emergency vehicle at rapid speed. Anytime an officer gets behind the vehicle, there is an enormous amount of liability associated with that. For countless years, officers in North Idaho have gotten this essential training at an emergency vehicle operations course at the Coeur d'Alene Airport. This will soon not be possible anymore as the airport continues to grow and the space becomes limited. This training is not only essential for an officer's safety, but also for your safety. The idea of picking up 911 and making that phone call and somebody not being able to respond because they can't meet the requirements, that's a scary thought. All cadets are required by the state to complete 40 hours of EVOC training. Once hired, officers are required to go through four hours of training every two years. The next place to get this training, Boise. It's a hassle on a road trip and it's an opportunity cost. These are officers that are no longer in our community protecting our community because they're having to travel to get the training that the state requires that they have. North Idaho College is where this academy is located. This serves the northern 10 counties. NIC has the land needed for this new EVOC center, but is lacking the funding for the facility. What this would mean if the funding does not go through? We would have officers that technically wouldn't be able to work the road. They wouldn't be able to respond to situations because they're not meeting state mandated requirements and training. Law enforcement agencies statewide are asking help from legislators to secure the funding to build a new facility, which is estimated to cost around $12 million. Reporting in North Idaho, Alexandra Coneyarts, 4 News Now.